So guys, for the first step, you wanna get into this screen. Now to get here, you wanna turn off your computer from the power button and then turn it back on again. As soon as it turns on, you wanna turn it off again and then turn it back on again. You want to repeat this three times. So you wanna turn off your computer from the power button and then turn it back on again. As soon as it turns on, you wanna turn it off again and then turn it back on again. You want to repeat this three times and then on the fourth time, when you turn your computer on again, it will then take you into this screen. And it's now going to be saying your PC did not start correctly, you want to click on advanced options. And now once you're on this, you want to click on troubleshoot, advanced options, and then command prompt. And now this will come up. And now once we're here, you want to type in sfc space forward slash scan now and then click on enter. And you now want to run this scan. Wait for this to load. I'm going to skip the video to when the scan will be fully completed. And now once that's been done, now you want to type in chkdsk space and now your windows drive letter. For me it's going to be c colon. For you as well, it's most likely going to be c colon. However, if it's not, then just change it to your windows drive letter. Space full slash f space full slash r and then click on enter. And you now want to run this scan as well. Wait for this to load. And now once that's been done, we can now close out of this. Now you want to continue to Windows and this should now fix your problem.